Okay, we are up and running and ready to go, I think. Uh, yep, looking good, looking good, looking solid. Uh, welcome to the stream. God, I look... I'm sitting like a fucking f real fat piece of shit in this chair. Uh, you know, like, slouched down like this. All right. Uh, should I post this on Discord? I already posted on Discord, like, a little while ago. So we are good, I think. Cool. I have no fucking clue what, <laughs> what we did in the previous episode. Oh, the Ruined Sentinels. That was the last thing. Yeah, we'll wait for people to join a little bit. Um, and that's about it. Yeah, Ruined Sentinels. That was the last thing. So what should I do? I really need to get more Estus. But I like legit forgot where all the goddamn flask shards are. Um, so I'm gonna have to cheat a little bit. Again. Since there is no one here, at least I can cheat in quiet. It's the shards. Dark Souls 2 Scar. It fucking knows what I'm thinking. Is the phone listening to you? Probably. Okay. Majula. Yeah, the mansion. We I know about the mansion and the skeleton. Soldier key, open. After gaining the soldier key, go up the stairs in the cardinal tower and open the door there. I have no fucking clue which one the cardinal tower is. Ah... Uh. Okay, but there is one in the forest. Lost Bastion. Metal chest behind Macduff. Did I not already pick that up? Am I a dumbass? I think I might be a dumbass. Okay. I'm going to... I have no flask shards. Yeah, seek, seek, last. I thought I moved Macduff. Oh wait, it's not this one. It's not the chest he's sitting on. I'm stupid. It's not the one he's sitting on. It's the one like actually behind it, like behind there. Where we'd have to go from the other way. Yeah, I th knew I looted this chest. Fuck, okay. Uh... I think I know which bonfire, I mean which door this is talking about. Yeah. Let's see. It's this one right here. I now know which stairs he is talking about. Yeah, the soldier key. And this is the one you could bust open. Okay. Is it actually possible to, creel, to kill crystal lizards with fist weapons? I think, think it's a challenge. It's gonna be a challenge. God, the darkness. This I do like that they increase the darkness. Is this a trap chest? No, it's not. Okay. Punch the shit out of this. It's not a wheelbarrow. What is it called? It's just a cart. And this should be it. Oh, fuck. Forgot about that. Genuinely. That was a flash shard, wasn't it? I did get one. Ye no. Am I stoned? Did I seriously not get a flash shard? Or is it that one you have to drop down to? God damn it. Bear with me. Oh, by the way, I have some people to thank. Uh, who was the last one where we left off? I don't know, if I thank you already, well, thank you again. 
we have Nando's G, Heavenly Heavenly Jeebus, Badge four five one 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 Magic Waffles, Nando's G followed again. Thank you. And we have Wick MA twelve ninety six. Thank you guys all for the follows. Listen, pro platforming. It's a divine blessing. Okay, I'm probably stoned. Whatever. We'll go back and check if I actually did pick up a shard and I'm just blind. Or it's in like a different menu than in uh, Dark Souls 3. Okay. Cool. Never mind. Uh, where did we left leave off? Could go to No Man's Warp, which would actually give us access to a shard, but we don't really need to go there. I'm pretty sure I just warped to the wrong place. I'm like 100% sure actually I just warped to the wrong place. Yep. Because for some reason the servant's quarter is in the is in the middle, it's a bit of a weird place to put it, but whatever. Man, you guys are quiet today. No one in the chat room. Sad face. I feel lonely. Let's see. I don't really need to come here. Oh fuck! There's another one. Hey, hey Kyle, no, it's not an issue, I'm just joking, of course. I'm pretty sure there's a flash shard here. Oh, I think I know what the issue is. Was I actually looking at scholar flash shards or normal Dark Souls flask shards? What the fuck? Okay, chill, chill. She just exploded. Oh, he's doing that? I didn't know he could do that. He's blowing his load. Hey, Kyle, thank you very much for subscribing. For two months. And you are on a one-month streak with Twitch Prime. Very much appreciated. Thank you for the sub. Twinkling Tight Knight. I think I have to be confusing my Dark Souls 2 Vanillas with my Scholar. I can't find flash shards nowhere. Oh well. Yep. This is... Mm, third favorite, I would say. <coughs> I like this... Like, you know, Dark Souls 1 is the OG fave. Uh, Bloodborne is the second. And then this game. But this is the game I play the most. Probably this is the Souls game I... I've played the most in my lifetime because it's so open, you know, like that's and it's like this is the most RPG. Yeah, fuck that. He's lying to you. That is a trap. So, yeah, uh, this game is just very, very replayable because it's more RPG like I, f I think than the other Souls games. Punch the shit out of these guys. I am playing a boxer, so... Gotta represent, you know. Nuke Skywalker, thank you very much for the subscription. Welcome as well. Really appreciate it. 
Did I almost got just wiped? Almost just get wiped? Thank you again, both of you guys. And thanks for all the follows as well and shit. Really appreciate it. I am fairly close to 100 followers, which is... I think that that will be a big achievement, getting 100 followers this quickly. Uh, it would be for me. Okay, you know what? Let's not rattle the thing we don't need to. Yeah, I think so. Like, again, if you're an RPG fan... <laughs> that didn't exactly work out. I feel like this is a game... This is probably the Souls, games, Souls game for you. You know? Is this gonna blow? No, it's not. I'm getting close to, by the way, I'm getting close to finishing um, the Dark Souls mod. What is it called? Daughters of Ash. So I'm already thinking of uh, new new playthroughs, you know. Yeah, this is still an aesthetic. This is a speed run, you know. I'm remembering all this shit from the speed runs. I'm so dead if I drop down there. Right? No, I'm not. That's probably the advantage that I'm wearing like fairly light equipment. And in this game, if you have light equipment, you actually take less. I didn't know that was. <laughs> Whoops. Okay, F. Type F in the chat. Uh, I'm dead. Really bad. That was a really bad death. Um, and it's not a, not even about the. Okay, whatever. It's not even about the souls because I sure as hell don't give a shit about souls in this playthrough. Cause I don't need them. But. That hurt a little bit, honestly. That ghost really scared me. I'm not going to lie. I thought there was like some ambush here. Whatever. So yeah, gonna be finishing Daughters of Ash, so I'm coming up with some new games. Uh, as I said in the last Daughters of Ash video, if you watched that, or you haven't. Uh, I think I'm gonna play through Rayman 2 on the channel quickly. I wanted to play Rayman 2 for a long time. Hey Nandos, what's up? Yeah, I wanted to play. Um... Oh shit. God, that's a lot of damage. Uppercut this bitch. I was the one that got uppercutted instead of him. Damn. I got outboxed. So, as I was saying, I wanted to play Rayman 2 for ages on my channel. It's one of my childhood favorites. And I thought, you know, why not? The divine blessings were supposed to be how you go through the lava. Oh, really? Okay. Oh, because they're, they work differently, right? They, like, increase your HP slowly. slowly. Shit, yeah. Oh, well. The second time I came through there, it was okay. Because I had a shit ton of HP. But, yeah. So yeah, Rayman 2 is first on the hit list, because that game is fairly short. Uh, it's a game I really enjoy. Oh, they increase? Okay. Okay, that makes sense. I didn't like, it didn't even, like, occur to me that they do anything with fire defense or resist. 
But what the fuck is going on? What? Where did you come from? And damn, these guys deal a lot of damage. Yeah. So Rayman, good old Rayman, we'll knock that game out. And then... I don't know. 3.14 p.m. in Brazil. Uh, <laughs> almost right. It's, uh, it's 8 p.m. So technically good evening, but it doesn't matter. Like that 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 much of a difference doesn't matter, right? Oh, and you need a fucking fragrant branch for this fool. What? You can unlock this? Damn. And what's in... What's over here? Is it just like a drop down? I guess so. Eight fifteen a.m. for us in Hawaii. Holy shit! Man, I wish I, I wish I were in Hawaii right about now. That's for sure. But okay, I mean, again, through heavy market research conducted by me over the past years, I figured out that this time like 8 to 9 p.m. my time is generally the time that's mostly good for everybody you know you have to strike a balance because you know pro streamers people who stream full-time they do like different times sometimes to cater to more like North American audiences to more European uh, because of the time zones Australian but because I don't stream full time, I can't really do that. But this time generally, again, it's not too early for Americans. It's not too late for Europeans. So it's the balance. It's bother This Estes shard thing is bothering me. Let me just check my be a professional streamer and check my phone again if I was stoned or not uh, oh dark so yeah I was looking at the wrong thing I'm stupid okay things betwixt oh you need a fragrant branch for that corpse inside the well outside the mansion got that one on a body on the platform where the early optional pursuer fight oh I'm gonna go get that one no man's wharf, you need a petrified, I mean fragrant branch. On a body near the lever that opens the shortcut to the boss gate. Okay, those are later ones. Cool. Got a break from college vacation. Oh, that's cool. Vacays are always cool. I'll have one in a few weeks. Uh, not like college vacation, but... I'll have a week off work. Um, I'll be traveling, but only for only for three days, so I'll have time to stream quite a bit. For me, OG Scholar versus I mean OG Dark Souls Two versus Scholar is kind of a mixed thing, like. I prefer some of this, some of Scholar. Uh, basically, I think the story is way better uh, in this game with the addition of Aldia. And I do like some of the changes, but overall... Yep, there it is. Overall, I gotta agree. OG Dark Souls 2 all the way.
think I said that I would go to the Shaded Woods. Right? I think we'll do that. So don't level up. Don't even think about leveling up. That's illegal for this playthrough. Basically illegal. Let me just check my... Okay, they're both at plus six. Hey Grim Reaper, what's up? And the Nightbot is here as well. The the OG Nightbot. Ah, fuck it. So yeah, I think I'm gonna hit up Shaded Woods. I think I've spent like 1-2k hours on... I'm probably in the same boat, honestly. It's a shame that the PS3 and 4 don't measure your hours like Steam does. Um, because it would be an interesting statistic. Again, because of PvP, the same for me. Especially OG Dark Souls, I PvP'd a ton. But good, good. All is good. It's trying to enjoy life with this shit weather that we've been having. Actually... Looking out now, my window, it's probably the first time that it's been sunny today. Uh, just the weather has been pretty awful, as you probably know. Um, yeah. I was just thinking how messed up it is that March to May was fucked up by COVID. The summer is fucked up by bad weather because we've been having... Like, generally, why did that explode? Um, bad weather. And fucking autumn is going to probably be ruined by... Or fall, if you're American, is probably going to be ruined by COVID again. Oh yeah, there was F1. Okay. And that's why I, I walk the dog in the morning. And in the evening. But that's about it. I went to uh, went out to eat. To a great place. Near the house. Whoa! Okay, stop missing. You can check your character time as long as you didn't delete them. Yeah, that's probably what. Because I've never deleted characters. In Dark Souls 2, I've never deleted characters. This is the worst fake cough ever, like, seriously. <laughs> PUBG. <laughs> you know, there was a crazy battle royale that I want to check out. I saw it on Critical stream, Moist Critical. What is it called? Cyber... Cyber Hunter. And it's fucking crazy. It's, of course, it's, it's a Chinese game, so I'm probably going to have all my data stolen. But it's a mobile game that was ported to PC and they kept crossplay. It's a battle royale. It's fucking insane. Like I saw it. Like if you're on PC, you're basically wrecking everybody's shit because like you're on PC and you have a mouse and keyboard and these fools over there are just like you know, swiping on their iPads. And it's free to play on Steam and I was like, you know, I got my ass kicked all the time in Fortnite. Time for my revenge. Gonna dunk on all these mobile players. Plus it's actually a... Like, it's a buggy game, but... It apparently has, like, some fun elements. Or, like, good ideas, you know. There's, like... Uh, you have the ability to summon a vehicle at any time. So, like... You know how in Fortnite... If you drop in, like, the other end of the map... And there's no one there. You have to sprint for like five years. And you just sprint, sprint, sprint. Only to get one shot headshot. So. Yeah, you can just whip out. You can just like whip out your shit. As in your bike. And you can just go through and like that. Which is pretty good. Gotta give it to them. Elysium, that's another one. Yeah. PUBG Mobile. Hmm. 
I've actually never played PUBG. Oh, the Vanquisher seal? Uh, I, I'm honestly not sure if it's worth the effort. Um, oh, you got the flu? Well, at, at least you didn't get the, like, corona, yeah. But that sucks. Like, I had a colleague as well who who got the flu in March. Like, imagine she was going crazy, you know, but they got tested twice and it wasn't COVID. It was just they happened to catch the flu at the same time. But it fucks with you for sure. Like, um, early April, I had a bit of a cold, just like a tiny cold. And I was mad scared. I was like, this is it, boys. You know, because back then, like, at that time, people didn't even know that COVID is basically 99.9% uh, .9 harmless for uh, people. Hold up. Oh, yeah, you have to open this, don't you? Yeah. So that was happening. Oh, there's there's fools here as well. Is this a scholar thing? Because I don't remember this. Yeah, a lot of people are saying that, you know, that they were sick. I mean, you know, you never know. I think in in Italy for sure, and I think in New York as well, it was basically confirmed that COVID was circulating way before March. Um, so you never know. I got tested though for antibodies. I I got an antibody test through means. I uh, I wasn't supposed to get one, but. I got one and I'm negative, so I, I've never had it. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Like Barcelona for sure could have been. I got wiped. Damn. Well, that happened. Let's try that. Man, this, this bonfire is awful. Like, this is not a good bonfire because of this stupid... Wait, why did it stay... Oh, Does it reset somehow? If you warp out, strange. There's a shit ton of messages. People still leave messages in this game? God damn. Okay, let's not. Yeah, the quick test, it only shows if you have it right now um. but whatever you know like my attitude right now is like I'm being careful but I'm also not letting it uh, fuck me up in any way you know I was pretty much inside my house except for walking the dog from March until May now shit is like finally lifting I'm sure as hell not gonna let it uh, like restrict me again and I'm not one of those like anti-mask assholes uh, you know be careful but also not be like terrified that's my approach Because my 
view is that a lot of shit can kill you in this life. Um, and this is just one of them. Yeah, I'm on PlayStation, yeah. Uh oh, what the hell was that attack? It's a fucked up uppercut. I guess PlayStation is the most active for this game, right? I think. <clears throat> oh, yeah, it's active on PC. Well, I guess PS as well. Of course, I'm hoping I'm not going to get invaded. We discussed this in the last stream. What a stupid decision it was. Uh, from FromSoft that they didn't include an offline mode for this game. Like, who thought that would be a good idea? I'm gonna pick up the Red Tear Stone. If this is even the Red Tear Stone. Or is it the Red Tear Stone in vanilla? That's... That's what I don't know. Fuck, you have a shit ton of HP. That has a shockwave. It has a shockwave. Alright, never mind. I think I'm just gonna run in and grab it and get out. Fuck that noise. It's probably not the red deer stone, right? It's something. It's like, turns out to be like a large titanite shard or some shit like that. Dark Souls 2 tracking. I, for <laughs> I forgot, like, fucking everybody is on roller skates in this game and can, like, instantly turn. I guess you can't turn if you're on roller skates. Um, but y you know what I mean. Yeah. And they're really, like, the two versions of this game fuck me up because I feel like I know vanilla Dark Souls pretty well. But this one is like all messed up. Oh god. It is the red tear stone. Okay. Like red tear stone is not that good in this game, but I guess it's worth keeping around. Like why not? You know? Or why not again? Is this gonna kill okay it's not. I'm always worried about falling in this game because like you step off a ledge and you die and sometimes in this game. That's what it feels like. Anyways, I'm like 90% sure there's a flash shot somewhere here. You shit bitch. Listen, don't ask me why jamming your fist into the back of this guy kills him, but it's Dark Souls 2 logic. You know. You know how it'd be. There's two. Okay, Red Deer Stone. What? Shit, I'm dying a lot. Yeah. And there is one reason I wanted to come in here. And that is to... I remember why I wanted to come here early on. It's to get Lightning Pine Resins. That's like the the goal here. I'm going to be dying a lot in this playthrough. Like, this is base level. Oh yeah, the Predator Spine Rip. Exactly. Except I'm basically on boxing gloves. Instead of a... There is a claw weapon in this game. Which I guess is more predator style. But... Yeah, I'm that... I'm that strong of a puncher that... Goes through the fool's back. So where did this motherfucker come from? 
The one that ambushed me. Oh, he's the one. Okay. That's fucked up. You know what? I'm gonna predator your ass. What the hell is that? It sounded like Facebook. Whatever. Ain't got time for Facebook right about now. Oh, okay. <laughs> no worries. Look, they, it, that's so fucking funny. The way they run. <laughs> cool. Look at that. I love it. Speaking of roller skates. These fools. What? It's really... Look. What is this animation? Fucking hell, my phone is loud. Yeah, parried my ass. That's pretty good. I like that animation. That was a good parry, yeah. It was a parry. That is fucking funny. I like the way those guys walk. They have Heelys on. You guys know that Heelys is still a thing? I'm just looking at it and I was like, damn. And that's a ghost. I'm gonna fall for that shit, ghost. Gonna get your ass punched. What is he doing? Okay, let's take care of ball sack monster first. And now we got time for this dude. Oh yeah, why am I trying to lock on? Yeah, I'm just gonna stun lock him. I think I am. <laughs> cool. Great. Nice AI. And there ain't jack shit here. And jack shit that I need. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. I guess I'm gonna go to the woods, pick up a couple of lightning pines. And then again, I guess go back to No Man's Wharf. Go through there. Do we even need to? Yeah, we need to. A lot of motherfuckers have died here. Huh. Oh, fuck. Okay, on a scale of 1 to 10... How much trouble am I in? I think I'm in a lot of trouble. There he is. Listen, bitch. I'm tired of your shit. Shit. I am in a lot of trouble now. Oh god. The How much poise does this motherfucker have? I want to see. Damn, he has a lot of poise. But he cannot deal with the almighty wall. God, you, you literally cannot interrupt him. Oh, shit. These are going to be interesting because he gets stronger, doesn't he? Hey, I actually stunned him. Okay, let's not, let's not be hasty. Fuck. Uh oh.
That's what I got for you, Forlorn. Hey, did you see what just went down, head? This dude is the OG God of War head, isn't he? Cool. Get the gesture. Uh, <laughs> yes. That's how you make friends in the world. With Palinka. That's a Hungarian way of making friends. Anyways, that was... That was actually a lot less bad than I thought. The headless bro right there always ruined your boss fight against... Wait, why? Can you like summon him for it or something? Okay. We are going to No Man's Wharf, I think. And I'm I'm feeling myself becoming an alcoholic, like with this weather. Like who wouldn't be? Slowly transforming. How the fuck did I get up there? Seriously. Oh, okay. Fine work. I'll rate it. Oh, and you can even get there. These are these are too good. But okay. So he, you can get up here pretty easily. I can't believe I'm wasting time on this. Whatever. Shit, I'm going to fall into a hole cuz it's actually this is fairly dark this area. Oh, should we have doggos? Okay, so I'm fairly OP for this area because of my weapons, but fuck. So I did 295 with Red Tear Stone. Let's check it out. Not on this guy. This guy is different. Oh shit. And I'm going to have to test it. Really? Huh. I never knew. I didn't know. But Ancient Dragon, like, what even can a summon do? I feel like that's a boss that would just, like, not work. Kind of like Gaping Dragon. You know how, like, Gaping Dragon just doesn't work with the retarded AI of this game are you kidding me think about sniping me don't I learn something new every day I guess but then it, like ancient dragon is even more of a challenge then right because he just gets more HP and you sure as shit don't want the Ancient Dragon to have more HP. Okay, how much was I doing? Oh, that's 295. I have to test the un... I should test the un... Uh, red Tear Stone did. Tear Stone did. <laughs> tear Stoned. Actually. I like getting a lot of equipment, which I'm never gonna wear. Oh, f what? Oh, it dropped from above. I was like, what the fuck? These dudes teleport behind you now. Nothing personnel, kid. 
This is the one you shouldn't kill, right? Because it's gonna spawn those assholes. It's like a hella boring boss fight though, right? Ancient dragon. Because it's more about like you messing up and getting hit by an unfairly large hitbox. From what I've seen. Fuck. What up? I mean, look at this, dude. She says, I thought that might be you, as if, like, we would be hard to recognize, you know? We've heard this story a lot of times. Flash shard? No, it's not. Three human effigies, though. I'll take that. That used to be a flash shard, right? Okay, that's a pretty good combo. Wombo combo. I should, yeah. <laughs> pointless. Someone put pointless here. Yes, man. It's fun playing this game with messages, though. This is a very observant community. God, the iframes, or lack thereof. Okay, so actually that does significant increases. I mean the red tear stone, because I was dealing like 295 and that was like 199. Or oh, 226. Okay, it's not that significant, but still pretty still pretty okay. What am I doing? I'm gonna get killed by these guys. I mean look at the amount of blood stains. Oh. I mean, I, at least I deal a lot of damage. I have a shit ton of life gems too. It's just the... The dodging in this game is insane. can't dodge shit in this game if you don't have iframes. What the hell was that? And there's no Gavlan here, right? Pretty sure there isn't. What up? I mean, you can go through this area fairly quickly. I'm really just because, you know, technically I've cleared this place out. I could go to the center, but you kind of need to do this area as well. What up, ninja? Oh shit, there's... Oh, uh-oh. I'm in trouble. I didn't know this, those guys were in there. Fuck. Okay, what we need to do is quickly go and unlock... 
the shortcut. I should be able to. What up, Gavlan? Wait, that's not here. There it is. Cool. Okay, we Gucci now. If I die, I'll be able to like sprint straight back. Because that's gonna happen. I was kind of... It was kind of predictable, wasn't it? Man, you know what's even weirder in this game? More, more strange than the like the insane tracking the insane 180 tracking is just like how active attacks are there's like no other way to describe it than to use fighting game terminology which i kind of hate doing because it's not a fighting game but that's how i i would describe a lot of attacks in this game that the active frames are insane Like, the fool ain't even raised his sword yet, and it's already doing damage to you. It's what it feels like. That's kind of the charm of this game, isn't it? It's a little bit special compared to the other ones. Am I a basketball shoe guy? Kinda. Yeah. I like me some Jordans. I don't actually own any Jordans, but I really want the the orange one. Oh, fuck. Air Force Ones, you know. The green ones are sick too. And the the off-white ones, but those are really expensive. I do like basketball. It's probably my favorite sport to play. Uh How do I get to the shortcut? That's the quickest way. I think you just gotta jump, right? Or drop down or something. Yeah, drop down. Okay, that did. I was trying for a sick plunging attack and it did not work. Yeah. The sevens are good as well. Fuck. Here it's like impossible to find them used. The US has a good like second hand sneaker market, which is sometimes bad because you know you have like scrapers, you know, people who set up bots and they buy all the new shoes before they like one minute after they're released. Uh the other side is like here they're easier they're easier to find in retail. Um Yeah, and it's like you can't do shit about it, you know, that's the issue. I think some websites have set up like uh you know, like verification checks uh, so that bots cannot get through. But then people found a workaround for that. So, you know, it's kind of crazy.
What the hell? I lit. <laughs> okay, I couldn't move there. Yeah, because, you know, that's the issue. Like, as soon as people are in a position where reselling shoes is their full time job, you know, like, they are basically invested in it now. Like, again, it's their job. So they will do anything to keep their job, you know. Which is understandable. But then again, it's like buying some shoe and putting it at a 200% markup on StockX is, is fucked up. I just realized I, that was pointless because I already had all this shit unlocked. Whatever. I could have just come here. Gavlan. This is the best NPC in this game. Gavlan deal. I wheel and I deal. Alright, what is this full cell? Ring of Giants increased poise. That might be a good one. Uh, poison Moss. But the better thing about this dude... I mean, it's kind of pointless selling my shit, right? Because... Because, you know, I have no use for souls. But I will like, buy a couple of these. And this guy is drunk as hell. It's what I like about him. Alright. There's also something over here, right? I'm glad I, they put this, these guys into the main game. Uh, you remember these guys were, they only appeared on New Game Plus, helping the boss. I think it's cool that they actually put them in the game. Oh god, it's so active. Get that poison shit out of here. Speaking of poison shit, I'm glad I bought this right about now. Wait, how did I not... Okay. <laughs> nice. Oh, it's like impossible to cr kill crystal lizards. Bust through that wall. Yeah, that was... I like that. Punch through that shit. This is a strong boy. Quite a few of these guys here. I think I can go straight to the boss. There is no need to mess around here except unlock the shortcut, which for some reason I always forget to do. We don't need to talk to Mage Dude, I think. Fuck. Got me with the kick too. I 
And this should be an easy enough boss. If I died to this, that would be almost as, almost as embarrassing as dying to the Moonlight Butterfly, which definitely did not happen to me. And I'm definitely not going to die here. The streets do remember that. It's like the wire, you know. The talk on the streets is that Mr. Sketchhead has died to the Moonlight Butterfly. Even though he denies it. Oh shit. Oh, oh, what? <laughs> Are you kidding? Okay. How much? No! I wanted to check how much HP I had. That had to be 1 HP, right? These swordsmen are assholes, yeah? That had to be a 1 HP survival thing. There's no way it wasn't. Mm -hmm. Second chance, you know? IRL second chance all the time. Oh, that intercept. Listen, you know what? I think I'm going to... Speedrun strat this. The streets also remember all the times I've survived with 1 HP, probably. Which has happened several times. Okay, this boss is a bitch, so I don't I don't anticipate too many problems. This is like the fucking announcer from, from the the pod racer scene in episode one, isn't it? Basically. This fool about to call out the Padres victory. Thanks Dark Souls 2. Appreciate ya. Yes, I knew you could stun him. Thoughts on the prequels? Uh, Phantom Menace is... Well, Phantom Menace would be a good movie if they didn't have Jar Jar and they cast a better actor for Anakin then it would be a decent movie and people would like it because I actually don't mind the politics part and Trade Federation and all that. I never did mind it, even as a kid. But the Jar Jar part and the kid being a pretty bad actor it's like not... kinda ruins it. But I like the, I like the general idea. Uh, Attack of the Clones is awful but mainly because mainly because of its terrible aged CGI and if there is ever a like living proof as to why a movie shouldn't overly rely on CGI uh, I feel like Attack of the Clones is a pretty good example of it um, and Revenge of the Sith is good that's just a straight-up good movie. I feel like Attack of the Clones is the worst, you know? People used to consider Phantom Menace as the worst. 
<laughs> unsub. Whoops. Oh shit. It doesn't heal you. Yeah, why would it heal you? There's been no bonfire since then. Wait, where does this put you then? Because I didn't hit a bonfire. This should put me back. Actually, where? This has never happened. It, but I liked Attack of the Clones as well when I was a kid. Damn, it puts you back. But does the ship come back? It does. Okay. Cool. I liked Attack of the Clones as well, but I feel like, again, like, it was on TV a while ago, and I just kind of watched it for a little bit, and man, is that CGI goddamn awful. Plus, the romance is just, you know, not well written. But again, like, it is what it is. Certainly those movies, all of them, had an impact, as in they innovated. Yeah, the Darth Maul fight. Really good. And I don't mind, you know, you, like a lot of people say they don't like the quick lightsaber combat. Uh, but I like it. I think it should be flashy and Mandalorian is good yeah but you know the the animated series Clone Wars is godlike that's god tier Not as god tier as Avatar, The Last Airbender, which is on Netflix, and I've been watching that. Um, man, is that show good. Is it, I feel like that's gotta be the best kids show of all time, right? Avatar. I don't know if there's anything that could come, like, even come close. Yeah, me too as well. I liked the droid versus clone thing. I liked it as well. And the big battles, you know. Exactly. Django Fat is badass, yeah. Have you guys ever played the the PS2 Django Fat game? Because that was like my favorite game as a kid. It was goddamn... I remember it being goddamn difficult. It's probably not as difficult as I remember it, but... It's how I remember it. But it was a good game. You played as Django... Before the... Uh, the movies. And then it's like the... Yeah, that was a good game. I don't know. Maybe it's just nostalgia blindness. Not as good as fucking Republic Commando. That's a god tier game. Did I... Did he seriously, like... That shit was mind-reading. It's unfair. It's some... Fucking Siri is reading my mind again. Yeah, Fast and the Furious is good. Yeah, Star Wars Bounty Hunters, exactly. That is a good game. Oh fuck, there's a Pursuer here. Yeah, there is. How am I gonna deal with this motherfucker? With three dogs. Did he despawn? I think I might have despawned him.
and I don't think he spawns again. Which is good, because I don't give a shit about him. God, turn around. Diablo 1 and 2 Age of Empires, yeah, exactly. That was like the, you know... Those games you just mentioned are like the fucking... They're the Eastern European classics, you know. Like everybody, if you're from Eastern Europe... And one of the Need for Speeds, probably. That's like the... Like Age of Empires, Diablo, Counter-Strike. As the Eastern... They should put that into the Eastern European collection or something. Yeah, the <laughs> exactly. Need for Speed Most Wanted. Oh, fuck. I'm so dead. No, I'm not. Did you see that? Hit up the bonfire real quick. Super Smash Bros. Melee. See, I got into that late. Um... I did did own a GameCube, but uh, are we done here? I think I can go back. We picked up a bonfire, uh, not bonfire shard, Estus shard. Yeah, the Melee series is... I have it, but I got it late, and people, people really didn't play that game. Not, not many people I knew had GameCubes. Well, that's a good game. I gotta get back into Ultimate. I always swear that I will get back into uh, Ultimate. I actually need to. Because I'm a little bit tired of Mortal Kombat 11. I mean, more on combat 11. Man, more on combat. It's a frustrating game. It is, yeah. Exactly. Somebody figured out how to put Counter Strike onto a USB, and everybody in the school fucking played it. Yeah, both. I mean, Super Smash is a huge competitive game. I mean, Ultimate. Except for the fact that everybody turned out to be a, a rapist in the community recently. Uh, or many of them turned out to be rapists. Um, yeah. But aside from that, it's a good game. Man, fucking Evo is cancelled as well. Because people are rapists there as well. Um, or like molest, like just don't molest people, please. Just leave, leave other people al alone. Um, you know, and then you don't get Evo cancelled. Maybe it's better that it's cancelled, actually, you know, because it was going to be an online tournament, too. And online fighting games tournaments are fucking awful. Um, as proven many a times recently. Don't molest, just molest star. Yes, exactly. That's like one of those, you know, words that fuck you up in Spanish. The other one I never got, or like I always messed up, is Dios. That it sounds like the, like it's pl plural, but Dios is just God. And there is no Dio. I always said Dio, and that's not correct. Fuck, I literally have zero iframes, it's insane. Yeah, I do. This is the part that sucks about this playthrough. 
My no iframes having... Do I even need to kill this thing? I don't, do I? I think I'm just gonna... Do this. Diosis. Yeah. That sounds weird as well, though. Yeah. It's like a diocese, which is something different, you know? Oh god, <laughs> this fucking, this fucking tracking, man, Dark Souls 2. Nope, I'm holding out. Oh god. <laughs> Look at him, he's like fucking, he's like the new DJI Osmo that I just bought. It like fucking tracks you, you know. Dios me dio algo as God gave me. Yeah, it's weird. That is weird. Because that, then it's Dios and Dio in the same sentence. I mean, all languages have weird shit like that. You know, you, you've probably seen, like, they have these English sentences online. That uh, they each have a different meaning. Depending on which word you emphasize. You know, it's like all languages are weird. Oh, by the way, I didn't know if I said, I mentioned it now, but I bought a DJI Osmo Pocket. I think it's sick. Because, you know... Motherfucker. I will, yeah, definitely. Look at this tiny ass ladder. Oh fuck. I didn't know you could descend. I'm dead. I thought I would like punch him out of the air, but it didn't work. So anyways, yeah, I bought a DJ. Actually, it's right here. In its case, because... I hate vlogging with my phone, you know, the few times, yeah, exactly, I've wanted to do vlogs for a while now, you know, but it's kind of uncomfortable doing it with the phone, you look like an idiot, oh shit, why do I always keep or forget to summon the elevator, but um, the Osmo is just like so small and so easy to use. It's just like, you know, holding it like that. And even the internal mic is pretty pretty decent. No cap. This, this fucking elevator is not going anywhere, is it? Because I didn't fully pull the lever. I cancelled my ass out of it. You know what? Fuck it. I should do this as well. <gasps> Excuse me. Of course that would hit me too. I've been filming shit with it, like my dog and stuff, and... Man, it's so easy to use. That's the thing I like about it. It's just like so easy. You pop it out, it's super light. And then you can just film. I also brought a, bought a wall mount to it. Yeah. That type of stuff, you know. And you can like, I have a car mount. Uh, well, it's like a combined wall slash car slash everything mount. So like car vlogs, you know. When I'm going to work and I'm bored, stuck in traffic. Although I've not been stuck in traffic much lately, honestly, because there is none. <sighs> Listen, on a scale of 10, how badly do you think I'm going to get fucked up? 
I feel like a strong eight, maybe. Yeah. It's a strong nine. Fuck, I was out of stamina. I am not do doing as much damage as I thought I would be. Whoever came up with this adaptability mechanic can fuck off seriously. I should have bright bugged as well. Thanks, Dark Souls 2. That was a 6. I, I agree. Yeah, gotta bring it down to a 6. No cap. <laughs> Listen. Don't need to convince me. I'll be David Dobrik, Dobrik actually, not Dobrik, David Dobrik, part two. Which he is part Hungarian as well, actually, because every everybody is, of course. Kesha, Kesha is Hungarian as well. Part, I mean, you know, like not, you know, like parents and grandparents and stuff. Listen, I think a bright bug is needed for this situation. What? Marry your friend's mom? Well, you know, it's like... Gotta get that MILF action, I guess. That was a great start. Man, this gives you a crazy amount of defense. The bright bug. Dark Souls 3, I mean 2, I don't even know which Dark Souls we're on, and he's almost dead, she. I'm gonna heal a little bit. Oh god, this game. Luckily, bright bugs last a crazy amount of time. Fuck. That was that was nowhere near me. Did you see that sword? <sighs> She's dead. 
that was not the most fun i'm gonna be honest no actually that wasn't so bad yeah it always it does always hit it has like a gigantic phantom hitbox around it it's all good This is all the is gonna be popping up, right? No. When does he first pop up? Oh, at the last one. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, the last one. Rotten is the same, yeah. Rotten and this boss are the big offenders, and there's a couple, there's actually a lot in this game that are offenders like that. It's because I'm too buff. I'm too buff for everyone in this world. That's why. We are going to get... More bright bugs. For sure. And a couple of these. And I can still get the cat ring which we're going to need. Not now, but later. Too swole, exactly. So I gotta get like some big ass gauntlets um, to increase the swoleness of this character. What up, cat? Uh, get this. Listen, it's the swoleness and the stash. Like, this mustache is unbeatable um, in its epicness all right Moglin you don't he's not selling any like shame I thought that I would be able to pick up some gauntlets but later because he sells like boss stuff doesn't he <laughs> yes, it, it basically is the standard character. Could you check if there's a hole inside Shalquar's cabin? What you mean, like a, a hole hole or like, I don't think there's anything here. I don't know about there being anything. There's a hole in the roof. But that's just a shittily made building. Did I just knock down the barrel? Yeah, I did. I'm gonna go back to... Things Betwixt. Next to the door. Oh yeah, there is a window. But there's nothing around it. This tent. Yeah, I'll go back to twin things betwixt, and I just noticed I have no flasks, which we will fix. Oh, inside, okay. Fine, I'll check it. I don't think there is. Oh yeah, there is. Weird. What the fuck is that? Huh. That's really strange. I didn't know that was there. It's a toilet. Maybe. Steve. Only logical explanation, right? I saw. Huh. I didn't know about that. See, you do learn something new in this game every playthrough. I'm going the wrong way. Why am I not warping? Don't ask me.
Okay, my navigation skills have degraded. There we go. That's really interesting. Actually. Holy fuck, there's a lot of messages. It's how we do. Okay, and I think this is where the... Yep, this is where we need to go. Fragrance this boy up. And again, there should be a flash shard right here. What the hell was that? Do you guys see that? That was crazy. Yeah, I never knew that was there. I'm sure it's hell gonna be checking it out every time from now. Yeah, no worries. Okay. Okay, on a scale of 1 to 10, I'm in a lot of trouble. Whew. That plunged bitches. Yeah, I'm sure as hell gonna be checking that thing out every time from now. That's crazy. Maybe there was supposed to be something there, but they just forgot to add it. It's like the only... Lo Whoa, do you see the... Yeah, the game stuttered like crazy there. Alright, I ain't interested in any of this shit. Uh, I came for the flash shard. Yeah, that's the only explanation I can think of, that they were gonna put something there, but they just kind of forgot. I'm sure there's like a 20 minute breakdown video of it somewhere on YouTube, uh, knowing the Souls community. So yeah. Full analysis, you know. Yeah, I'll I'll still be here. Go on. Always good to get something to eat. All right. Question is, where do we go from here? Because we did Bastille. I guess we can turn that... Oh, you know what? Before we go any further... I should finish up Forest. As in go to the caver dude and all that. Huh. Damn. Like the map dude or whatever he's called. You know, you know who I'm talking about. But first things first. Oh, I only have one of these. I'm probably not gonna waste it. We'll come back here later.
How do you make it over here like this? There we go. Expert platformer. Dark Souls 2 platformer. Fuck. Deserve a backstab for that. Hello, goodbye. Giant fucking boulder. That's Indiana Jones, you know. There he is. Did he seriously just shoot me? This dude likes the maps. I think there is good items in that mansion. That's why I wanted to come down here. Do I have any homeward bones? Oh yeah, I have a ton. Cool. I'll use it. I started yawning like crazy. I don't know why. It's not even that late. Damn, I have only 10 minutes worth of torch. Okay. That's interesting. Got a lot of skellies to kill before that. I like that they re-added this mechanic though. Um, as advertised originally, you know. Because they needed to port the game to the next gen consoles to be able to do this. Gotta assume the swole stance. I guess this area is easy because these guys are weak to blunt damage. They've been taking a lot of damage from... Yep. I kind of was thinking that. Yeah. This doesn't make any fucking sense, but it's all good. Why punching one of these things would hurt it. Hurt it this much, especially. But hey, ain't complaining. Greedy. God, it's so slow. Healing in this game is insanely so slow. I know. I don't know why I'm doing things in this order. It's just whatever my ADHD mind remembers should be done. 
It will be, definitely. Um, I'm only gonna be wearing pants and gauntlets for this entire playthrough. Which will make Liam Lois very interesting. You know. This is a bitch. Whoa, okay, that's slightly more damaging than his magic. God, he has a, everything has so much poison in this game. Yeah, again, the order of things, again, it's literally just what I remember. Whoa, hello. Heal, bitch. Gonna ambush him. Told you. I guess they don't. They don't stagger that well. Which is weird because I feel like they should. I don't know. It feels like it. Yeah, because it didn't work on Forlorn either. I gotta sort that through my equipment as well. I said I would finally, for one time in a Souls playthrough, I will keep an organized equipment uh, set. You're back. That was quick. You didn't miss too much. Let's go to the mansion. Now this should still contain a flask shard. If I remember correctly, it definitely contains uh, good items. This book is so weird. People used to think this would be a DLC entrance. I remember. It certainly looks like one. I can't blame them for thinking that, honestly. This is my favorite hub, by the way. I gotta, I gotta admit, Majula is sick. Cause it actually feels like a real place, you know. Sith, <laughs> Seath's VK spot, exactly. His fucking like weekend retreat. I'm totally lost. Oh, there it is. And that thing I always think is a chest, but it's not. Every single time. Yeah. A good bit of ice cream is difficult to resist. Today wasn't hot enough to have ice cream. Shit. I knew there was still a flash shard here. This is unchanged from the vanilla game. Okay. I don't know what I should do next. I keep going to the wrong menu. Yeah, 
The flavor is crucial. We have some crazy ice cream here. We have chestnut puree, which is pretty good. Some chocolate flavor. Uh, Americans have Ben and Jerry's though, that's the... That's the real shit. I love Ben and Jerry's. But here we have Cartador, which is like the European... The European like good ice cream... Makers. And they have some good ass flavors, like the aforementioned. Let's say go. Let's Google Translate this bitch. It is peach. It's peach. Peach ice cream is pretty good. Sorbet, I'm assuming more. I don't know why I'm going this way. This feels like the way I want to go. Fuck, Microsoft account problem. Get out of there. Lavender. I've, I've had lavender ice cream before. I It was not my favorite, but it was okay. A bit too... A bit too, you know, perfume-like. Oh, brownie batter, yeah. Gotta admit, this playthrough is very satisfying. Uh, this punching is kind of the whole idea of it. Punching my way through this entire game. It's pretty good. Man, this skybox is so much better than anything in Dark Souls 3. As in, especially the flat fucking... You know, horizon line. Coffee ice cream is godlike, yeah. A good coffee ice cream and it's sick. Green tea, I like green tea as well. Fucking, you know, green tea mochi ice cream is so good. Lemon, lemon is good. Yeah, coffee is probably my favorite too, actually. Oh, fuck you. I f <laughs> Damn. What a way to get killed. Oh well. That's a pretty good... I gotta admit. I gotta give it up. That's a pretty good ambush. Um... I, I like that ambush. So let's redo that without dying. <laughs> yeah. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I knew I was in trouble. I forgot that there's a guy behind you. There's a lot of... Like, again. Like, obviously there's gonna be a lot of deaths in this playthrough. 
it's just kind of how it is like zero hp and zero adaptability oh you made ice cream okay that's even it's even better than just having the store one Alright, so, there's a dude that ambushes you, but from where, I don't, where actually, oh, he's just here, how did I miss him then, must have been like a blind idiot, oh, and then this fool, he got into the mix as well, and him, And there's this many. Hmm. Uh oh. Why is this area like so strangely difficult? I'm getting my ass kicked. I got, I got you now. You're gonna trick me twice. It's not even a good item. It's a cracked red eye orb. You can get to a good item from here. <laughs> Straight from the other. <laughs> they got them special ice cream cows, you know. Just milk it and fucking vanilla ice cream straight up comes out. That's good. Like homemade ice cream. What the hell is... This area is stoned, I swear. Okay, I never managed to do this correctly. Case in point. Look at him, he came after me. Nice. We had a suicide pact, you know. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's the... You're right. Yeah, you gotta jump and then... You gotta do a plunging attack. That's it. You are correct. God, this is nerve-wracking. <gasps> Don't even think about punching yourself off. What is a token of fidelity? It's one of the covenant items, right? And then it leads here. Yeah, thanks. I completely forgot that that was the solution. I gotta get that the fuck out of here. What? They have one of these things here? Are you kidding me? I'm dead. I was poisoned. Whatever. Like, who gives a shit? The good thing about these runs, these level 1 runs, is that you don't even have to care about your souls. It's like... Whatever. Alright. Listen. Looking at the time, I think... There's no point to start anything else, as in like new, because I have like only a few minutes left. So I think what I'm gonna do is I'll wrap up the stream here. I feel like this is a good place to stop. Uh, we can go through the forest next time. Uh, here is how it's gonna be. Uh, next stream is gonna be Tuesday. Yeah, Tuesday. 
we'll continue from here tomorrow probably gonna finish up daughters of ash monday i'm gonna post the first episode of this if you need me i'm here on discord always or instagram or wherever yeah thanks for watching thanks for stopping by it was nice talking to you guys and see you on tuesday and on youtube as well all right peace out